one word that describes Color War is mishpacha or family. Color War is crazy. Color War is exhilarating. Color War is intense. Color War is tiring but amazing. Color War is memorable. Color War is obsession. The whole school is divided into two teams and we compete in different competitions and games and we even do showcases and present some artistic things and then on the final night we have the whole school come and watch and it's super fun. It was just an amazing event watching students put on these productions and organize the week and come up with a final presentation. It's truly when I first saw the, the Ramah Magic, the DJDS Magic that we all you know, talk about. Um, that was the first uh, program I really saw it from. We all go to school normally, and for the first couple of periods, right before lunch, you know, it's just normal school. Usually people, you know, they know what's about to happen. And so, whenever they call us to the gym, act like something really serious is about to happen, then all the seniors come rushing in and they go, it's color war! You know, and I think that's really funny and incredible. I remember when I was in the lower division, color war was the weirdest thing because all these kids would come running into the building and would be screaming and cheering and trying to get us to jump up and down and you'd be like, what is happening? Color War is about a team and it's about putting your heart and soul into that team. And it's about taking a step back and looking at the bigger picture and saying, what can I do to help? What can I do for this family? There's so much kahila and community and like the cheering. We're all just like in a circle, jumping up and down and screaming at the top of our lungs and losing our voice. It's like our goal to lose our voice at the end of Color War. I would say one of my favorite memories was when I got to tour the classrooms that got decorated the day after Color War. And I was just so excited because they looked so cool. My favorite part about Color War is being able to connect with people in older grades that I don't usually talk to. And of course winning. Tug of War was one of my favorite Color War experiences in fifth grade. It doesn't really matter if you win. It's just a game and it's really fun anyways. I know how important Color War is. I know the passion they feel and it makes me more empathetic with them during Color War. Like I know what it feels like to have the world literally fall from the ceiling in your room with two hours before judging and then being able as an adult to talk them through that and help them manage these situations and use conflict resolution and just making it a better experience for them. You have to see it to believe it. It's something you gotta witness. You have to go all in and in that sense, that means losing your voice, helping younger kids become leaders, bonding with friends and sharing memories with friends, connecting with teachers and administrators, and these bonds and these friendships that they create, they truly are legendary. I think leadership skills that you can make in color work translate to other aspects of life, especially when being taught the dance one moment and then teaching everyone else the dance two seconds later. It's just a really good opportunity to not only see yourself, how you are acting in a situation like that, but also see how you can act in the future like that. It being a small school, you know, we can really focus on our community and we can really like bring those bonds and focus on those bonds and make them stronger. I think it's really special in that way. Hi.